Hello and welcome to the Etika World Network News segment. My name is Etika, corresponding for this news story today. Why are people pulling out their measuring tapes at Subway restaurants? Well, a recent Facebook picture is actually the culprit behind the reason. A person in Australia, uh, specifically Perth, actually went into a Subway restaurant to purchase a sandwich and he noticed that his sandwich was on a little bit of a lean side. So he pulls out his measuring tape and it turns out that his sandwich measures only 11 inches. Now, Subway customers are doing this nationwide because the photograph itself received more than 131,000 likes and thousands upon thousands of comments. Four out of seven $5 footlongs purchased at Subways in Manhattan, Brooklyn, and Queens measure only 11 or 11.5 inches. Because of this, the craze of people measuring their sandwiches is all over the United States right now. Even I've done it myself going to the recent Subways that are around here in this neighborhood. And let me just say, most of the times my sandwiches only come up to 10 inches, maybe even 11 on a good day. and what's going on? Etika from the Etika World Network now coming to you in 60 frames per second in terms of the news videos because I read somewhere that news is typically done in more frames per second typically like maybe 48. I'm doing 60 just to see how it looks. I wanted to save my 24p, that cinema quality, for my cinema projects. So like, for example, music videos, um, any scenes that I want to film, things like that. You know, I, I want to make sure that that is saved and reserved so that when I actually do a cinema project, it looks like it's cinema and not just the rest of the stuff that I do. So everything else is going to be brought to you in different frames per second. I'm going to have my news videos brought to you in 60 frames per second and probably my product reviews brought to you in 48 frames per second. So just so that things have a different look to them so that when you guys see that I'm doing a movie production or like a cinema production, you're like, wow, this looks like a fucking cinema production. So that's exactly what the thing is going for. And you guys will be able to tell that things are different with this video because things is moving like real fast, you know. It's, it's like, oh, oh. The guy seemed like he was really desperate and I was like, you know what, I feel bad for this fucker. Let me just help him out. So I did just that. And oh man, I don't have a problem with helping people. I don't. If you really need the help, I don't have that much of a problem with doing so. But here's what really grinded my gears. Less than three days later, less than three days later, the motherfucker comes on and he's all like, oh, my channel may be shutting down soon. I need donations from you. Are you, what? Let me tell you, this guy's statistics, he had 1,400 subscribers and you know, he was doing this thing. I'm not hating on him for that. I was at 1,400 at one point. I'm at 5,600, no big difference. But the guy was asking for donations from his subscribers. And let me tell you, this is all true story. This is all a true story. If you want to know who this guy is, you can message me on my Skype, I'll let you know. But this is a true story, man. So then this dude, he comes onto my Skype and he's all like, oh, you know, really, I need some kind of money from you, man. You have money, I know you have money. You have subscribers, you have fans and all that. I'm like, dude, you know, you're getting kind of forward here, you know, like, come on, man. And so then, oh, man. Projects for green projects. We in the, right in the middle of the beast zone. You know what it is, man. Just got out from school, niggas bags and shit. You see that shit? We just got out. Anyway, yo, we chilling in front of the SLJ building, a high school that I go to. And we don't give a fuck. We just here to spit right now. What to kick an ice session with a new MC fresh off the motherfucking block? Eleven inches. Eleven inches. Oh. 